a different kind of award or honor depending on your background. This video covers my initiation to, which is a huge honor in the system in which it happened, uh, into Alpha Z Delta Sorority, the chapter University of Washington in the 2010 autumn quarter, quarter which it was approximately, if I'm recalling correctly, I think it was like end of October, mid-October, end of October, kind of, I think, or beginning of November, but I think it was October. Not certain about that. And the Greek, it's called the Greek system, so it promotes kind of Greek culture, Greek language. We did actually have to, so essentially there's, in the story system, there's rushing, and that's where one goes through and um, chooses slash is assigned a house if one makes the cut. And at the University of Washington, we were allowed our to rush our freshman year. And um, it is a highly competitive thing. Uh, and it, the Greek system at the University of Washington housed like 10% of the student body and had like 4,000 residents or something like that. So it was a big system. And uh, once I rushed, so I got into Alpha, Alpha Z Delta, there's a lot of learning Greek culture. We actually did have to learn and were quizzed on, tested on the Greek alphabet, um, stuff like that. Uh, it's kind of one of what aren't the planners in the planets in the solar system named after Greek gods or something like that. There's the Olympic Games, there's democracy, there's the Greek system, which even just that one school is 10%, right? Thousands of people. And that's a nationwide thing in the United States of America. Right? It's kind of like if there's an empire that exists today culturally where a country in its heritage and practices of the past are continued to this day, I would say the empire of today, I'm filming this Saturday, 14, October, 2023. Yes, 14th. And um, in the community of Innisarden, city of Shoreline, King County, Washington State, United States of America, Planet Earth, the original. It, the Greek empire is kind of the current um, history, peoples of the past that are kind of at the top. Right? It changes with time. Um, currently it's Greek, it'd be nice if it were something other than, like, European. <laughs> um, but anyway, so this is about the initiation part. So initiation was like a formal ceremony. We were assigned our bigs. No, we were, no, we were assigned our bigs. So there's rushing, there's this big assignment. So that's where we get paired with a sorority girl sister they're called sisters and there's family trees and stuff and i'll show you mine um and or what was mine before i quit and so there was the rushing assignment big and little so i was the little and she was the big and then initiation and so at initiation i got there was a formal ceremony there was like we had to wear certain attire we got a book from our big, so this is my book, and we got to sit in a room and she, she kind of talked to me and stuff. We got to sign, this is like signatures and notes from the fellow initiates, because um, I was in my class. Um, not everybody, so there's, it's, it, it is a cut competition, so to speak, in that not everybody who rushes makes a sorority, and not everybody who makes a sorority passes initiation. But you have to be in good standing, not drop out, that kind of stuff. So this is me and my big, so big and little. My name is Tannis, Corley Rianardi. This one is me, not Tannis, and this is Heidi, my big. Or who was my big before I quit. So this is a sorority for me, 24-7 living, Greek culture, Greek system, for was what I did September to approximately March and there was some weeks away for like um and days away for vacation stuff but I I lived there even on the weekends because uh, I had work at Evans Pool on Green Lake in Seattle so I yeah I, <laughs> I worked in college <laughs> in um like in a phys at a physical place so in the sorority was closer to my work than like going home on the weekends and stuff and so, you know, it's, it's, it's very different than, say, something like the Olympic Games, where somebody goes and might, you know, what would be the analogous thing, actual time competing. So somebody might spend three or four hours competing at the Olympic Games, and that's it. And one Olympic Games and Olympic Games, at least currently, are held every approximately four to five years, um, four or five years. And so 
<laughs> three to five if we wanted to be really nitpicky. And so, right, I did 24 seven for like six months <laughs> or six to seven months. And so I like, if you want to understand the Greek system and live the Greek, well, like, like the Greeks, including architecture of houses, um, language, traditions, the Greek system in America is kind of like, if you want a big system and to be part of a bigger picture, it's kind of the Greek system. Um, so Alpha Z Delta, it has, this is a book my big put together for me. It talks about the history of it. So ours was founded in 1893, April 17th in Illinois at Lombard College. And um, then my big wrote a letter note to me and we had our pledge class. It's called pledge. Um, uh, and then there's a quote and then we did men came and serenaded us and performed for us and so we had to get dressed up for that kind of stuff and so we'd stand out in front of the houses the men would serenade from fraternities would serenade us um then we have some stuff we did like with men from fraternities so like here's me and jessica noir i think she was part of my pledge class and then some guys we were at a fraternity paint war with frater frat men um <laughs> there's more of the paint war um so they, those were called socials where we would meet up with men from other fraternities this is my family tree <laughs> okay so i had a big which also means i had an aunt and then this is our family tree or um like let's see and there's me at the bottom right um kind of thing uh and then they have information so my big so it should be like my big sis Kind of is like sister. Um, then my aunt Zola and my grand big you know, um, is Kristen. And then there's me painting a man's back at a fraternity, the paint war. And then I got letters from a bunch of people in the sorority, from my sorority sisters. And I got this when I was initiated. This was part of the initiation. And when I quit, they took everything with my letters and the pin I bought, which is a quill back. Um, but I gotta keep the initiation book. So I thought I'd show that. Um, yeah. I quit the sorority in 2011, approximately, well, I, or moved out as in like physical quitting. It was approximately March 2011. And um, I quit the University of Washington in 2012 and transferred to the University of Hawaii at Maunoa in Honolulu, Hawaii. Um, so it was just, Culturally, I'm not a Greek by ancestry, and I'm not a Greek by choice. Um, um, maybe a hindsight way of phrasing that, and I'm not a Washington by blood, and not a Washington by choice. University of Washington. Right, um, so, yeah, that's a, a little bit about that. And, and this is meant to be about the honor of getting initiated, because it is a super cut, and there's a lot of, you know sister uh, like family tree greek system kind of family thing um analogy yeah but since i wore t-shirts back then a lot of v-neck t-shirts i was like i should film this one in a t-shirt it's not <laughs> kind of thing so yeah that's a little bit about that uh it was an honor it was perhaps like the most ceremonial of any honor i have ever received that is the Greek system. <laughs> that are, that is the Greeks, um, for better or for worse. Um, I, I just I do remember going and being like, watch me be descended from like Nero or Brutus or something of, like Nero of the Roman Empire, and I'm like, why am I living in the Greek system when the Romans and the Greeks are notoriously well? That feud has not ended, right? They're still enemies, and I, and I was like, maybe I shouldn't be in the Greek system, and I left. Yeah, so there's a little bit about that. Oh, and we had like, um, there was like, there was a lot of sorority events, um, kind of thing that we did, including like going out into a cabins in the woods somewhere and stuff. And it's just, and I ended up being house manager and I think it was health and wellness chair and stuff like that, which were like uh, positions in the house, um, making, make, getting sorority girls to clean, you know, and like making sure things are in fire code, make sure we have good stuff to eat, stuff like that. So that's a little bit about that, but that, um, definitely an honor in the system in which I received it and 
Yes, the, the most ceremonial of any award or honor I have received to date. Happy day and time of viewing and happy place of viewing.